Sam, welcome to York City. How are you feeling? Yeah, I'm um, buzzing to be here. Can't wait to get going and um, help the lads out. Yeah, what was the motivation to sort of step out, not, not, not say comfort zone, but step out and come into this sort of situation with five games to go? Well, obviously, I've had a couple of loans before and I really enjoyed them. To get to express myself and go and play and show what I can do. So when I heard about coming here, it was a definite yes. Yeah, talk to me on those different low moves. I think there was Morpeth in there, Lancaster, Blythe, a couple of different clubs yeah. around the north. Um, they sort of set you up for you know what you're going to come into with sort of men's football. Yeah, obviously going into going into Lancaster at a young age, I was only 17, so that's put us in like good stead for coming in loans later on in my career because I've done it from early on. So going into Lancaster and Morpeth and Blythe, it's all it's nothing it's nothing new, but. It's just good, good to get it in early, so you know what, know what to expect. Yeah, you scored a few goals at Lancaster, as well, from yeah. what I've seen. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I got a few. I was there, I was only there for a short time, but managed to grab a few goals while I was there, and um, yeah, helped them lads out as well. What do you know about the York season, sort of at present, and where we are at the minute? Yeah, obviously, the the league table's mad. It's like what was it six points between the uh, the drop in twelfth or something? So it's anyone's for the taking. So Obviously, I want to come in and help the lads stay up and stay in this league for next season. Sort of style of play as well, is that something that suits to you? Yeah, um, see, good at hold up, hold up play, and then obviously everyone, all the striker wants to score, so get in around the box and get some goals. Fair session for you with the lads today, I'm, I'm assuming. Uh, how was that for you? Yeah, it was good, good to meet all the lads and uh, see what they're about as well, and um, see see how we play, so be good, good to get into a game tomorrow. Did you know any of them beforehand? Um, no, not really. No. no. Anyone no. stand out to you straight away? Uh, I don't even know the names yet, to be honest. <laughs> but now nah, everyone was sound. Everyone was good with me. So yeah, looking forward to the next few weeks. Be very honest. <laughs> <laughs> Is it good to sort of know that you've come into a dressing room and immediately sort of the world taken to you really well? Yeah, obviously. Because um, at a young age, you you, you don't want to be too shy because. It's, you, you need to get yourself out there and show them what you're about. So it's always good to come in and just get on with everyone straight away. Talk to me in a season with sort of Fleetwood and the development side of things. How's that been for you? Um, yeah, it's been good. Good club, uh, good club Fleetwood, and been playing in the 21s this season. And the lads there are great, and we've had a very good season so far. So it's been it's been very good with them. So I want to come here and do what I've been doing there and bring it to York. Yeah, you made the switch from Carlisle to Fleetwood in the summer and uh, initially sort of Carlisle, you made his league debut there, a few League 2 appearances. Yeah. What was the initial, uh, what, what were you thinking when you moved to Fleetwood in terms of your development? How did you see it going? Well, Fleetwood obviously, the facilities are, are great, aren't they? So, and I heard about them going into Cat 2, so moving up a category, like academy wise. So I knew straight away that they, they had a lot to offer and all the facilities and the staff and everyone there, it's just, it's just really good, I enjoy it. Yeah, is excelling sort of in youth football something you really want to do as well as trying to get the men's a you know, more senior tough side in as well? Yeah, 100%, obviously, wherever you're playing, you just got to do, do your best and the youth level and 21s level, you want to obviously score as many goals as you can, but you want to move to men's footies as, as soon as you can really, because that's the reality and it's you're not going to stay in uh, youth football your whole life. Describe yourself as a player for those who you know, maybe won't know. Um, I'd say my hold-up play is decent. Um, obviously, getting other players, getting other players into play, bringing bring the ball down, and obviously getting in the box and getting some goals. Out and out centre forward, or do you like to be out wide as well? No, nah, just just centre forward. Just yeah. centre forward. Never played anywhere else. <laughs> <laughs> a nice easy one to sort of ease you in with yeah. the, the Champions Chessfield on yeah. Friday. I'm looking right. forward to that one. Yeah, I've heard I've heard how many people will be here, so I'm expecting it to be be a mad crowd, and obviously that's what you want to be playing in front of. You want to be playing in front of full stadiums and um, loads of fans. So yeah, can't wait. Yeah, it could be seven thousand to see you out there tomorrow. Yeah, that's what I mean. That's what you want. You want to be playing in front of big crowds. There's loads of people watching. You go express yourself and see what happens. How does Sam express himself? By scoring. <laughs> and obviously, good performance. Um, being tidy with it and yeah, obviously want to get want to get my goals. So yeah. A little message to the fans ahead of the game. Just get as many fans there as we can and uh, support the boys on, and we'll we'll do our best.